guys so welcome back to my channel I feel like I've been slightly incognito this last week or so uh, school has just been absolutely crazy I had a 10 page paper and a midterm here and a midterm there and it was just <sighs> I'm glad that's done so I did get to go out for a little bit after my crazy week and do a little bit of shopping and so I have a few things that I want to show you guys and stick around and enjoy. The first place that I went was Play-Doh's Closet. They are, even though they had their bag sale last week, a few weeks ago, they have all their clearance stuff on for 50% off still. So I went there to see if they had any new stuff out and they did so I got some new stuff there. This was the first thing that I got. I thought that it would be great for when the snow is melting, which is, it's finally melting. Oh my gosh. It is beautiful outside. I have been on walks every single day pretty much. Um, just absolutely loving this weather and that the snow is finally leaving. I got this. It is just a denim top, but the interesting detail about it is it cinches at the bottom, which is nice. Quarter, three quarter sleeves and it'll be perfect for right now, finally. I don't have to say for when the snow stops stops melting, starts melting anymore because it's melting. Got this pink pullover. It's a little bit um, worn so I think it'll just be for around the house but I really love the color. It is billabong. Lots of signs of wear but super comfy, very pretty color. I just really liked this one. I got this little crop top. It's got like a ballerina type back here. It's sheer. Just very pretty, very simple. Love the colors. Um, love anything floral, very feminine in my style. I love pink, I love floral, I love hearts. So this just really fit in with the things that I like. I found these mint pants and they are a beautiful color. This color is so popular. They are guest... I don't think they're jeans. What are they? Guest pants, they just... I just love the color. I had to get them. Um, for a great find. They're going to be awesome to pair with like a pair of brown flats when now were very nice for me. I got this big pullover here and what does it say? It says believe in love. I don't know. I don't really like cheesy slogans but I mean if it doesn't say something stupid then I guess I'll buy it. Um, it's by Old Navy. There tends to be a lot of Old Navy things that like thrift stores and secondhand stores because their stuff typically is not great quality I find but I like this it was still it still has quite a bit of wear in it so it'll be nice to pair with a pair of capris found this oh how would you describe it it's like doily on the top and lace on the bottom um, from Urban Planet I believe or Stitches or Blue Notes somewhere along those lines uh, it was only a buck fifty so I just grabbed it much to say I like the color I like ivory egg shelly ish I went there actually intending to look for white tops so I guess this was a good compromise the next place that I went was Liquidation World um, Bianco Amores it is basically a store where people bring all of their stuff that their store can't sell and so Bianca Moore sells it for them. So they buy it and then sell it. Same stuff at a discount price. I got four things from there. The first thing was this balancing body wash by Raw Essentials and it just looks like this. Um, I haven't had... no? I used it once and I didn't like the smell. It smells kinda... It smells like it's trying too hard. It smells kinda like sugary musk, like sugary bark. I don't like the smell, nothing special about it when I used it, but it does say raw, so maybe that's what I'm smelling. Maybe I am smelling bark. Bark is raw, I think. Got these skincare triple action cleansing wipes, and they're anti-wrinkle. They just, I use them to remove my makeup sometimes when I don't feel like getting a cloth or when I'm just not sitting in the tub and don't have time to wash it off have been pretty good to me. Um, they haven't dried out. They have a very nice seal like on the top. It's just a little hole where they pop out and then you can reseal it and it keeps all the moisture in. Uh, I haven't done anything to cause any breakouts or any redness or anything to my skin so I really liked these ones and they were obviously $1.50. The next thing that I got was this Maze Cosmetics and it's just a little like duo um, eyeshadow. Oh, 
I did not, I was not thinking there. Um, it's pretty pigmented. Um, it doesn't stay on very good, so I think I'll have to use a pretty thick primer if I am to use this again. But I just love the colors. I think gold anything goes great with my skin tone, so... I just wanted to try that one and it was only $1.50 so I didn't really lose anything and I may may use it again. So I might be in a different spot, I don't know, am I close, am I far, I can't see. I never quit so let's get back to it. Next thing that I got at Liquidation World was this lipstick, looks like this, it is in 205 Smolder, it is a brown color and I've always wanted to try like a brown lipstick. The swatch, um, if you can see it, I don't know. Where can you see? Yeah, I've just always wanted to try brown lipstick. It is what I'm wearing today. It, it has been what I've been wearing recently, um, about this last week. Guys, it happens every time. I don't know, just really great lipstick. I believe it is originally by CoverGirl, if I can remember correctly. I took the tag off, so don't count me on that. Go to the boring thing first. Target is closing again, blah blah blah. Uh, me and my boyfriend needed reusable bags because whenever we stand in line at the grocery store, we always do a guess of how many bags we need. And it's always between five or six, maybe less, but that's how many bags we usually get. So we got some reusable bags and they all just look like this. Um, I think it might be the Target symbol, I'm not sure. Makes sense, hopefully these will say salt. the Hopefully these will solve our bag issues. Um, and we got three of these, so we'll see if they're quite big. Very nice. I'm excited to use these and not have to get little plastic bags because I always feel guilty when I throw them out. And the last place that we went was Bath and Body Works and they were having their... Um, they got a bunch of new hand soaps and their gentle foaming soaps and I believe that they do have soaps that have like those little beads in them like those soaps so we didn't get any. We got all, we got five and they were $22.50 for five I believe which I mean it isn't horrible but it kind of sucks because after they gave us a $10 off coupon for hand soaps and then today all their hand soaps were $3.50 and I don't know. It just did not work out in our favor, but we got them and we like them, so it was a good purchase. Um, the one that we got was my choice and it is Sweet Pea. And it smells sweet. I don't think it smells like peas, I think it maybe smells like flowers, but close enough, right? This one uh, was Aaron's pick. And he was just feeling jungle passion, jungle, jungle passion fruit when we went there. Does not smell like jungle, but I'm not sure what passion fruit smells like. So maybe it smells like passion fruit. Either way, it smells like really good. This one was also Aaron's pick. He thought that it would actually smell like apples, which it might. I don't know. Ooh, it's leaking. Yeah, it smells like apples. I don't think anything that ever is called green apple actually smells like green apples, but the smell green apple always smells like green apples. If you know what I'm saying, it smells really good. one that we got was my choice. Um, I can never pass up anything that is uh, the scent vanilla. That smells like vanilla. It smells like sugary vanilla. I kind of want to eat it, but I probably shouldn't. Um, Beautiful one, beautiful design, love these hand soaps, perfect. I will probably never buy another hand soap in my life. But, thank you guys for watching. I will get some more videos up, hopefully. I am getting my wisdom teeth out next week. May not film a video next week. May not film as many videos as I'd like next week, but I will definitely get some more out. Be sure to subscribe and like and comment so that I know what you guys like and want and do. Thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.